Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Tech, and here's what's going on in this video. On this phone here, I have the redesigned Google Messages application specifically for Samsung phones. Let me launch it, and it's going to be right here. That's the brand new Google Messages application redesigned for Samsung phones. And just a quick few highlights. If I go in over here, I have a bunch of new features here. These are the Google RCS features that I can now use on this phone. Uh, I can get red receipts. So if somebody sends me a message and I read that message, I get a nice red receipt. And also I can press and hold on a message bubble and I can react to that. So I can give a thumbs up, I can press and hold, I can laugh at it or whatever. And there's a bunch of other features. In this video, we are gonna quickly talk about what's going on. This is a developing story. Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Tech, and in today's video, we are going to be talking about the redesigned Google Messages application with RCS capabilities for the Samsung Galaxy smartphones. Now, I have that redesigned application right over here. So that's Google Messages on Samsung, designed for Samsung in partnership between Google and Samsung. So when I launch this one right over here, it's going to look slightly familiar if you're a Samsung user you have the One UI theme on it, okay? Now, this is not happening to all the phones, but it's happening to some phones in the world, around the world, right now for One UI 3.1 and above. Here, I have a Samsung Galaxy smartphone. This is a US model. This one doesn't have it yet. So the default right now is the stock messages application, which is this one right here. That's just a regular stock Samsung messages application. This is the Google Messages redesigned specifically for Samsung smartphones, uh, again, in partnership between Samsung and Google. Now, let me show you one more thing. If you were to go to Play Store right now, and if you're in the United States, or if your phone is not supported, and you download the Messages application, the Google Messages application, here's what you're going to get. Let me just launch this. Let me set this as default, okay, real quick. So let's uh, do this, set as default. This is what you are going to get right here. So they look kind of similar, but I'm unable to bring this one down, okay? So this one can go up, and now they look almost identical, but this has the capability to actually come down with one finger. That's a property of one UI, and I can actually access messages from here, okay? So again, to be crystal clear, this is the Google Messages application that is now shipping stock mostly with flagships like S21 around the world and the long-term plan is to make this the default everywhere. So in the future, when you buy a Samsung phone, they're not gonna have the stock messages application, which is this one right here. Okay, let's just tap on okay real quick, go back to default. This one is gonna be gone, replaced by this one. And the reason they're doing this is to, to unify the messaging experience across Android devices. So it's all one application, all the same features, just like iMessage for iPhone. And of course, thanks to Google having the RCS capabilities, let me show you what they are, by the way. I'm gonna tap on settings over here, go to chat features on the top, and you can see that we can send red receipts to the other side. We can show typing indicators. So when you're typing, the other person can see that you're typing, and that's a popular feature in iMessages, so you can have a live conversation. So let me show you if it works over here. Let me show it to you real quick. I'm gonna go to Messages, okay? That's Google Messages. I have RCS enabled, RCS enabled on this one as well. So I'm gonna go over here. These are the two guys talking to each other. So take a look at this one. I sent a bunch of messages that I have not read yet, and I can also see three on red on the top. That's also a new feature with this new design, okay? the regular messages application, Google Messages, does not get that. But if I click on this, now I read all three of these guys, okay? Now, what should happen is, uh, when the RCS completely works, I should be seeing red at the bottom here. Let me see if it works right now. I'm gonna send a message. It's gonna pop right here, okay? Okay, there we go. So it says right over here, red. I saw the message and I got a red receipt right here. Let's do this on this side. I'm gonna say hi. You can also see the chat bubble. 
Look at that, it says red. So I read it over here and I got a receipt. And when I type stuff, you can see we have that chat bubble going on over here, just like iMessages. And another thing you can do is uh, you can press and hold and you can react. So let's just do this. The same thing happens over here. And I can react from this side if I wanted to. There we go, okay? So these features are part of Google RCS and by Google making a special app for Samsung so it doesn't look out of place, it's in sync with the One UI uh, template that we have. So if I go to my settings, that's what One UI is supposed to look like. I'm supposed to be able to pull this down and things come down. So I have it here now, okay, as you can see, okay. And by doing this for uh, Samsung, Samsung is satisfied. And also, uh, Samsung can easily use Google RCS features that I showed you just now right over here, all right. All right, so let me give you a quick summary. So some Samsung phones are getting this Google Messages application specifically designed for Samsung phones by Google. Now, most phones are not gonna see this uh, S21 series around the world, except for the United States, might start to see these features. Once you have it on your phone, what you can do, like I said, is you can go to your settings and you can enable the chat features, okay? And when you're in the chat features, you get access to all these cool things here, sending red receipts, showing typing indicators, and a bunch of other things that are gonna be added very soon. Everything else here is just regular messages application, Google Messages. So all these options are gonna be found on any phone. The big thing is with this Google Messages application, it's gonna be specifically designed to fit into the One UI theme. I hope that clarifies it for you guys. It's a little bit confusing, I understand, but just wanna make sure you guys understand exactly what's happening. Now, this is not available in the US yet, but like I said, it is available around the world for S21 or basically for any phone running One UI 3.1. It is still being deployed. It's in the initial phases. I'm just giving you guys an update before these things even become mainstream. So make sure you stay tuned for any updates. I'll let you know right away if there's anything else happening. Now, if you do have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know. For now, guys, have a fantastic day, all right? All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.